right, so it's day two of uh, day two of our weekend together here. We're at a place called uh, Adams Farm Pond. Haven't fished here before on the channel. Got a nice little fountain that we're going to be aiming at, obviously. I'm going to try over here really quick near the uh, the boathouse first, though. We got some nice structure. It's a little public uh, water park slash pool up there. And uh, we've never managed to get on much here or anything, but we were in town because we were looking at uh, Dick's Sporting Goods and Academy Sports, and then we figured, all right, let's come fishing. And this was the closest spot. But it is, uh, it is a very nice spot. Hmm. Uh-oh, now I'm on the house. <laughs> that ain't good. Whoa! <laughs> oh boy, I'm being an idiot today. Yeah. Yep, that would have been a good idea. Alright, let's try the fountain. Wow, that's a nice size bluegill. That's bigger than we typically get here. He's right up on the bank. Huh, really? Yep. Reel in here and I'll... There he goes. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Stop, 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 stop. All right. Don't there you go. Don't yourself silly. Nice little size bluegill here. Good job, good job. Nice kill. Looks like he got attacked at one point. Yeah, he's got a little spot there. Mm -hmm. He's sitting right up on the bank. Yeah. Might be about to get rained out here. I welcome the rain. Yeah, you can feel a little chill on that air. I like it. Yeah. Got crazy all of a sudden. I know that doesn't sound too good for the camera there, but oh man, does it feel nice. Well, I'm just gonna cast with the wind, I guess. Can't cast into it. Ooh, that feels nice. Getting some spray from the fountain here. Rain starting in 99 minutes. 99 minutes. This is yeah. Kind of black. Oh, dang it! They want the wind is messing with me too. Another bluegill. Yeah, he's a more unique variety though. Nice. You can just barely see the beginnings of his little copper area. Yeah. Nice. That's neat. Alright, well, uh, here's something we haven't caught here yet at Adam's Farm. A little largemouth on a worm. He fought like crazy. Yes, he did. See, he's still fighting. Come right on, on, buddy. Right up on shore. Oh, sorry, I hate to treat him like that. Alright, good job, babe. Thank you. That's a not insignificant sized bass. <laughs> For me. Yeah. I usually catch the inch long little bass. Yeah, there you go. He was caught right up on the shore. That's a good four entry there. <laughs> <laughs> All, All right. right, nicely done. Thank you. Ooh, right in the eye? Yep. I'm going to have to be real careful when I get him out. Let me see that with the camera here. He's in the brain. He snagged in the brain, I think. Because he's twitching. Uh, yeah. I never did. I've never seen that before, but damn. I did not intend to do that at all. I was just reeling it back in real slow. And you he, hooked his brain. He got himself. He tried to take off and he got himself. That is ridiculous. I've yeah, he's never really seen anything twitching. Like that. We'll take it out, see if he'll live. 
Look at that. He's bleeding. Holy hell. Well, uh, put him back in, see if he swims off. I hope so. We'll see. Oh, he did. Huh. He swam right away. Well, maybe he'll be all right. Who knows? Yeah. Maybe you just missed his brain. I hope so. I guess we'll know if we see him floating up. Yeah. That was weird. I've never seen someone do that. I see rain out there. Where? See the bands? As well leave, right? A lot of wind in that storm. Alright, well, that's what you call striking out. Although a couple fish were caught. But I'm not getting totally soaked. You never just come here and fish. No. Should have what? Should have left him. Yeah.